the swimming pool on the weekend. Okay. Can we go on Saturday? I'm busy on Sunday. Yes, but I always play tennis in the morning. Let's go in the afternoon. Okay. See you there. <laughs> Two. I want to have lunch in this restaurant. Can I park here? No, sir, you can't. What about outside the movie theater? No parking spaces there. A lot of people leave their cars outside the hospital. You can park there. Thanks. Three. Can you help me with my homework? Not now, sorry. Can you help me after lunch? No, I'm busy. When can you help me? After dinner. I don't have any plans tonight. Four. Let's write a postcard to Chris. Do you have a pen? Yes. Here you are. What about a stamp? We can buy a stamp in the store. Okay. Do you know her address? No. Do you? No, I don't. Five. Okay, let's go in. Sorry, we can't. Why not? Is your boss here? No, I can't hear him. But it isn't that. It's the door. Oh, now I understand. You can't open it. No, I don't know where my keys are. Beleza, então o que a gente nessa questão? When can they go to the swimming pool? Quando que eles podem ir para a piscina? No sábado de tarde. Number two. Where can the man park? Onde o homem pode estacionar? Outside the hospital. Lado de fora do hospital. When can she help her brother? Quando que ela pode ajudar o irmão dela? This evening. Esta noite. Já que ela fala after dinner. Depois do jantar. Tá? Four. Why can't they send a postcard? Por que que eles não podem enviar o cartão postal? They don't have the address. Eles não têm o endereço. Ok? E por último, Why can't they go in? Por que que eles não podem entrar? Por que que eles não podem entrar? Né? He can't find his keys. Ele não consegue encontrar as chaves deles, né? Ele não consegue abrir a porta, ele não consegue abrir a porta, mas principalmente porque eles não podem, não podem entrar, porque não tem a chave, né? Enfim, essa foi, vamos para a próxima. It's Holly. It isn't Emily. It's Beth. I'm Emily's sister. Oh, hello. Um, is Emily there? No, I'm sorry. She's taking the dog for a walk. Oh, well, can you give her a message? Yes, of course. Can you tell her my bag is in her car and I need it? Oh, your bag. Okay. Does she have your number? I don't know. Okay. Wait a minute. I need a pen. Okay. What's your number? It's 606-555-4923. That's 606-555-4923. Yes, that's right. Wait a minute, Holly. Don't go. I think Emily is opening the door. Emily, it's for you. What? Oh, the phone. Hello? Hi, Emily. It's Holly. Oh, hi, Holly. How are you? I'm fine. Listen, my bag's in your car. Is it? Yes, and my keys are in the bag. And I can't open the door of my apartment. My cell phone's in my bag, too. So I'm calling from the apartment next door. Can you give me my bag? Oh, right. Yes. Yes, of course. Let's meet in the cafe near my house. Okay. Thanks, Emily. No problem. See you in a minute. Bye. Hello, and welcome to Who's Healthy? Today we have Marge Wilson and her son, Robbie, with us. Marge, do you think you're healthy? Um, yes, I think so. 
And what about you, Robbie? Are you healthy? Of course! Well, I'm going to ask you some questions, and we're going to find out who's healthy. First of all, Marge. How old are you, Marge? I'm 48. Okay. So how often do you eat fast food, Marge? Never. I don't like it. Okay. And how often do you have breakfast? I always have breakfast. I have a cup of tea and some cereal. Good. And how often do you exercise? I go to the gym three times a week. Okay. And how many hours do you usually sleep? Well, I get up early, and I always go to bed early, too. I usually sleep for about eight hours. That's great, Marge. And now it's Robbie's turn. Robbie, how old are you? Twenty. And how often do you eat fast food? Well, I love pizza and hamburgers, and I sometimes have french fries, so yeah, I eat fast food about five times a week. What about breakfast? How often do you have breakfast? I don't have time because I always get up late, so I hardly ever have breakfast. Okay, and how often do you exercise? Oh, I do a lot of exercise. I play soccer four times a week. Good, that's better. And how many hours do you usually sleep? I'm not sure. I go to bed late because I'm on my computer, so I guess I sleep for about six hours. Okay. Thank you, Robbie. And now it's time to see what the doctor thinks. Dr. Atkins, who's healthy? Marge, Robbie, or both of them? Well, Marge always has breakfast, and she never eats fast food. She often exercises, and she gets a lot of sleep. So, Marge, you're right. You're very healthy. And what about Robbie? Well, Robbie exercises four times a week, but he often eats fast food, and he never has breakfast. He doesn't sleep enough either. So, Robbie, you're wrong. You aren't very healthy. So there you have it, everyone. A healthy mom and an unhealthy son. And that's all we have time for today. Join us again tomorrow at the same time for Who's Healthy?